The Octopus Bar in Wallingford tries to keep focused on good drinks and good times, but the pandemic's forced all small businesses to make some tough decisions. When you operate a bar, you try to avoid politics at all costs because drinking in politics is dangerous. But for us, it's the safety of first and foremost, the staff. They posted this TikTok sharing that even though King County no longer requires them to ask for vax cards at the door, they will still require proof of vaccination. Whatever hyper consciousness I had of the staff before is even more so because I mean, when that vaccine mandate first started, we had door guys that were just getting berated and it was all pretty rough, but we got through that. And the last thing I'm going to do is go back and then go through it again. They're one of many Seattle area businesses that say they just aren't ready to make the switch. This isn't us saying that because you think this way, we don't want you here. Ultimately, we do want everyone here. We want everyone to be here and feel comfortable, but the priority has to be what feels safest. And obviously we're not scientists or medical professionals, but this is what's gotten us this far without any major incidents. So we just have to stick with it. And then hopefully it's all gone and everyone can come back and we just don't have to talk about it ever again. They say hopefully that time is soon. It's just not now. In the meantime, if you aren't vaccinated or have an issue with showing proof, you can check a restaurant or bar social media pages or call in before you go. Steve. So, uh, Erica, the governor says that the mask, the state is going to lift its indoor mask mandate on March 12th. So what did they plan to do with that? Well, at this point, they say that staff are OK with dropping masks entirely since people don't wear them while they're eating or drinking anyway. Back to you.